Well, greetings, you goddamn legends. Welcome to another video. This time we're taking a look at the Marvin Cowabunga. You know how long I've been waiting for this? Ooh, I'm about to make a name for myself here. Bandai, Bandai, Namco, Bon Presto figure. And it's from the Celestial Vivi line. Yeah, baby. But anyway, here's the box, there's the front of the box, there's the side of the box, there's the back of the box, there's the other side of the box, there's the top of the box, there's the bottom of the box, there's the box at an angle, there's a box at a different angle. Are we done with the box now? I think we are. Really good. And here we have Merlin fully assembled this? out the box. And one funny thing to point out is that uh, her head was already popped out of the uh, plastic when I took her out of the box. No idea why I need to uh, mention that, I just thought it was slightly amusing. So, yeah. Anyway, here she is, uh, not much really required, just need to pop her on the base and voila, fully assembled masterpiece, and overall, it's a pretty good figure. But anyway, taking a closer look at that noggin first, and I think it looks pretty good. Me when, my, my face when, me, me, when, 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 me when I tell Xbox is my turn on the brother. Wait, what? Um, yeah, she does have a very funny looking expression, which looks pretty good. You know, sculpted nicely, painted nicely, she does have some blushes here and there on the cheeks. Very subtle, I don't think the camera picks up on it too well, so I guess you have to take my word for it. Yeah. yeah! One eye has been printed pretty damn well, while the other one is also pretty well printed as well, but it's closed. There you can see some jewellery or piercings on the ears there, and on the other ear as well. Got some studs. And as you can see, the hair has been sculpted rather nicely. There's some uh, paint detailing here on the top of the head there. It's a bit pinkish and then do the pink ends as well no ugly seam lines from what I can see or at least it's blended into the hair pretty nicely so yep can't complain there unless you do and moving further down and good god she is pale where does the black top with some uh, jewelry here and there is that even considered jewelry I guess it is right knowledge in the uh, jewelry department is uh, quite limited as I don't usually wear them um, yeah black top it's a torso looks like a torso the fingernails has been painted there rather nicely. Then moving further down, yeah, black skirt, legs, they do in fact look like legs. Um, yep, and for those fellow scientists out there, there's the upskirt shot. Uh, just some basic red high heels there, so overall, it's a pretty basic outfit, but I think it looks pretty good. I do especially like that face, it's rather goofy and funny looking. But anyway, moving on to the... <laughs> Why am I adjusting a camera while I, uh, speak? But anyway, moving on to the size comparisons, here we have a Marvin Kawabunga. A Marvin, a Michael, and a Marin Kitagawa. But anyway, that's what this video. If you enjoyed, like, subscribe, if you want to. Until next time, bye.